大家好，我是 Angel。啊、uh, ，我是 Jeremy。嗯，今天的课程是上网。Uh, getting on the internet。嗯。So I noticed in our dialogue just then, the、uh, the two people were getting on the internet in a cafe. 对，他们是在一个咖啡厅。嗯 ，Is this usual？ 嗯，是。现在越来越多的咖啡厅都有了无线网络。Uh, so there's more and more cafes where you can get wireless, right? It's great. 嗯。Okay, let's go through the dialogue now, line by line. 嗯，好的。这里的咖啡真不错。Uh, the coffee here is really good. 嗯，红茶的味道也很好。嗯 ，The red tea tastes good too. 几点了 ？What's the time? 两点十五分。Two fifteen. 不好意思，我和 John 约好两点半在网上聊天。Sorry, but at two thirty, I'm supposed to be chatting to John online. 嗨。啊。服务员，你们这里可以上网吗 ？Waiter, have you got the internet here? 可以，我们这里有无线网络，您可以随意使用，是免费的。Yes, we've got wireless. You can use it at your own discretion, and it's free of charge. 服务员，这里的网速太慢了，是不是信号不好 ？Waiter, the speed of the net here is too slow. It's because the signal isn't very good, right? 我们这里的信号很好啊。可能是因为您登录的是国外的网站，所以速度慢一点。The signal here is really good. The reason the speed is probably a bit slow is because the website you're trying to visit is foreign. 原来是这样，我的电脑快没电了。你们这里有插座吗 ？I see. So it's this. My computer is going to run out of power soon. Have you got a power point here? 就在您桌子下面，非常方便。It's just underneath your table. Really convenient. 这我就放心了，谢谢。That's put my mind at ease. Thanks. 嗯，是很方便 ，really convenient. It is indeed. Yeah, wireless, <laughs> 无线的网络。Yeah. 嗯，呃，下面我们看一下今天的语法点。第一个是因为所以。是不是信号不好？我们这里的信号很好啊，可能是因为您登录的是国外的网站，所以速度慢一点。Okay, so let's check out the、uh, grammar points for today.、Mm. And the first one is because something, therefore something.、Mm. So this is a structure that we use、uh, when we want to talk about the reason for something. It's very, it's a very、uh, simple structure to understand for English speakers. And let's just have a look at、uh, how it works now in the first example. Okay, 因为他学习努力，所以成绩很好 Okay, so because he studies hard. Therefore, his marks are really good. Yeah. So the first part of the the、uh, the sentence is obviously the reason. Yeah. 原因 And the second part is the result. Yeah. 结果嗯嗯 Okay. How about the second sentence? 嗯，下面一个例句是因为孩子病了，所以我今天不能去上班了 Okay. Because the kids were sick, I couldn't go to work today. And again, yin wei is because, and that, and after yin wei, we put the reason, and then we say so yi, which is therefore, and we put the result. Yes. So it's very simple. Very simple. Hmm.、Mm. 第二个语言点是原来。原来是这样。我的电脑快没电了。你们这里有插座吗？ Okay, so the second point of grammar here、mm. is yin lai,、mm. and the best way to translate that is. Actually, yeah, it's actually.、Mm. So, it it's it's a bit different though. We have to、uh, clarify it and say that usually we use yuan lai to indicate that we've come to a new understanding about something that we previously thought,、um, and we were previously incorrect about it. So we've come to a new understanding that is correct,、mm. and what we thought previously was incorrect. Yeah, just like discovering a fact. Hmm. Hmm. Finding. That's right. So can we have a look at the example sentence? 嗯，好。我还以为打电话的是小王呢，原来是你啊。Okay, I thought that the person on the phone was Xiao Wang,、嗯、but actually it was you. Yeah. So I thought incorrectly. Yes. And then Yuan Lai to say actually、嗯、it was you. Yes. Okay, can we have a look at one more example? Yeah. 我以为他病了，原来他出差了。Okay, I thought he was sick, but actually. He was on a business trip. Yeah. Okay. So I thought incorrectly that he was sick, 
But it right. turned out, actually, Yuan Lai, he was just on a business trip. Yeah, later, and later it came out, came out that he was actually on a business trip. Yes. Okay, that's it for the grammar points at the moment. Yeah. Uh, why don't we give them a few tips now? Mm, okay, A few Please. bits of useful information. Mm. Okay, so today we are going to extend on this uh, vocab for internet, mm. and uh, or internet-related vocab. Yeah. And uh, we might as well start with chatting. Now, we all know about text-based chatting on things like MSN, which is hugely popular in China. Mm, um, but apart, apart from the text, mm. we can also use voice and video. So how do we say voice chatting? That is 语音聊天. 语音聊天. Mm. So that's like something you might do on uh, Skype, for instance. Yeah, Skype right? or MSN message. Mm-hmm. And then there's video chatting, and how do we say that? Mm, that is 视频聊天. 视, okay. And, and that comes from, the, sorry? And that is come from, I mean, 视 means watch. Watch, So you right. can see each other from the camera. Just another word that has that, that, uh, that word in it that's internet related. Uh, uh, webcam, how do you say that again? Webcam. 摄头. 摄像头. 摄像头. Yeah, that's it. Right, so that's that word again, 摄. Yeah, 摄. Okay. It's a 摄. Right. Mm. Okay. Now let's talk about um, some other popular words when we when we uh, refer to the internet. Mm. And one of them is social networking on websites like Facebook. Uh, How do you say social networking? This 社交网站. So 社 is. 社 actually 社 means uh, society. Okay. So it's a different 社 from the one we spoke about earlier. Yeah, different. But the same pronunciation. Okay. And jiao? And jiao means communi- communicate. Communicate. Mm. Okay, and of course, wang jiang is website. Website. Right. Mm. And then there's two terms that I want to clarify for everyone and for myself here. First of all, blog. How do you say blog? We call blog bo ke. And how do you say podcast? That is bo ke. So they're very similar. Yeah, but different so terms. Can we hear them one more time? So blog is bo ke. And podcast? Great. Yeah. Okay, that's it for today, I think. Yeah, so uh, hopefully you have some happy surfing on the internet and mm. visit www.mandarintube.com. Yeah, your Chinese learning channel. Okay, thank you. Bye. Okay, bye.